What is going on, everybody? My name is Pete, and you guys are watching Pay to Drive and Pay to Drive Vlogs coming at you with another brand new video. I hope you're all doing great out there. Let me know how you're doing in the comments down below. And of course, if you drive for apps like Grubhub, DoorDash, Uber Eats, or any of the others, you're in the right place to stay up to date with what is going on in the gig economy. So get started right now for free. Hit that red subscribe button down below and turn on all notifications so you're always notified whenever I post something new. And of course, don't forget to hit that like button down below. It just lets YouTube know I'm doing a good job. Leave a comment right now saying liked, L-I-K-E-D, just so I know you did it. And let's jump on into it. All right. So this here comes from my buddy, Tom Perry Vuozo or Vuozo, I hope I'm saying that right. And this is in regards to uh, that video that I was talking about where DoorDash is wanting to buy Instacart and some people liked it, some people didn't, but listen to this. So Tom says, Pete, any, an any acquisition is bad. And yes, an attempt at monopoly. When companies are gobbled up, pay will go down. Bad, bad, bad. Pete, this doesn't mean more opportunities. It just means the opportunities will be all DoorDash instead of Instacart. That's not more opportunities. It's just the same, just under the garbage pay from DoorDash. A new company would mean more opportunities. Think about it. DoorDash is just trying to monopolize the market. They're close to being a monopoly already. Bad, bad, bad. So before I go any further, do you guys agree with Tom? Do you disagree with him that monopolies are bad? Uh, in some, in most cases, they can be, you know, because look at that. DoorDash, you know, picked up Caviar. Postmates was picked up by Uber Eats. Because if you remember, I used to always say, you know, uh, if you guys drive for apps like, you know, Grubhub, DoorDash, Uber Eats, Postmates, Caviar, Instacart, blah, 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 I used to list them all off. And now I'm just saying, well, there's the big three. There's Grubhub, there's DoorDash, there's Uber Eats. And that's basically it. Other than, you know, the other less desirable ones, let's say like Spark or Shipped or whatever. And then of course, Instacart has, has gotten huge ever since the pandemic started, um, where people were just saying, you know what? I don't feel comfortable going out and getting my own groceries. I'll just pay somebody else to do it because it makes me feel safer, you know? And again, that's someone's complete prerogative. I mean, during the start of the pandemic, uh, eventually I was using Shipped uh, through Target to order a lot of groceries and stuff like that because I have a lot of health issues myself, which has prevented me uh, from being a full-time driver anymore, you know? So, I mean, I could talk about that in another video uh, at another time, but yeah, guys, I mean, my, my whole thing is this. As I've said, and Tom feels that it's not that way, but if it created more opportunities for drivers or dashers to make more money, I'm all for it. But Tom's saying, I don't think that's gonna be the case. He goes, if there was a new company, yes, that would be a bigger opportunity for drivers to make more money, but that doesn't seem to be the case here, at least according to what Tom is saying. Now, Tom is an extremely loyal viewer of my channel, and I trust his judgment, you know? Um, you know, he's, he's been around this, this industry for a while, so he, he has a really good grasp on it. So with that being said, guys, in the chat, in the comments, do you think that DoorDash purchasing Instacart and, you know, becoming one company is good or bad overall? Like I said, originally I was trying to stay optimistic about it, you know? I almost feel like I was being more optimistic, Tom is being more realistic. Not necessarily negative, but realistic. Um, and I feel like that's why it's so awesome that I can go over the stuff that you guys have to say because I'm just one person with one opinion and one thought about everything, which is why I try my absolute hardest to include you guys into the content because it's not just my channel. It's not just paid to drive, it's my channel. When I created this channel in 2017, it was to um, put out my experiences and stories so that you guys could check them out and I could hear your experiences and stories and then include them back into the videos. You know, So that's why I feel like it's so important to do that. So seriously guys, in the chat, in the comments, load them up as much as you can. Do you think DoorDash buying Instacart and creating this acquisition is a good thing for the company or a bad thing for the company? Remember that in office space? Is this good for the company? 
put some office space quotes down below too. And guys, if you ever have anything you want to send to me, a comment, a question, a story, uh, an article, whatever, send it in an email to paid to drive stories at gmail.com. That information's in the description, just where everything else is. And if you guys want a quicker response from me, you can reach out through Patreon at patreon.com forward slash paid to drive. I have that link in the description down below or in the pin top comment if you guys want to check that out. Um, and of course, anyone who signs up as a patron, my way of saying thank you is I give you guys shout outs in all my new videos, which I'm about to do right now. So when you hear your name called, say, hey, Pete, I heard my name. We've got the very generous Samantha Michaels, Brian Pomeroy, Brian Medina, Heidi Barnes, Ivan Jerome Gilroy, Joe Valerio, Angela Counts McCarty, Kurt Paul, Lee Peacock, Tulsa Todd, William Boudreau, Laura Love, Agus, Tom Perry, Alan G. Van Horn, Lawrence Brown, Drew Hanor, Fernando Carranza, Frank Haviland, Fresh One, Jason Casta, Justin Case, Lulu Laura, Natalie Mosley, Sarah Keston, Scott Freisner, Sherry Cassidy, Stephen Neely, Joyce Heim, Brian Richardson, Kenny Bess, Ginny Thomas, Candace Mitchell, uh, John Bonacci, Matt Epperson, Nick G, Stacy Miller, Terrence Pacheco, and Valerie Brown. So huge shout outs to all the patrons. Uh, if you guys want to check it out, like I said, scroll down. Link's in the description or the pin top comment. And uh, who's going to be the next patron? I don't know. Let's find out. And of course, I hope everybody out there is saving money on their gas with the free app called Get Upside. That link, of course, is in the description. Scroll down and, down and then click on the link where it says download the free gas app. Click on there, it'll tell you how to download it to whatever kind of phone you have, anything will work. Then you go to your gas station, pump your gas, print out your receipt, take a picture of your receipt with the Get Upside Gas app, and within 48 hours or so, you'll get anywhere from 15 cents to 45 cents a gallon back, which is pretty fantastic. And if a friend or family member signs up using your code, you'll get paid every time they pump gas. It's called Get Upside, link's in the description. Make sure to download it today. And of course, if you want one of your own Live to Drive, Drive to Live t-shirts, you can get your own for sale at on, for, on sale at paytodrivestore.com. We have lots of brand new designs. We have colors, sizes, all that good stuff for all your t-shirts, hoodies, and goodies. Check it out, paytodrivestore.com. That link's down below in the description, or you guessed it, the pin top comment. And of course, everybody, uh, if you made it to the end of this video, I'm extremely grateful for you all. Let me know by leaving a comment saying end 605, E-N-D 605, just lets me know you made it to the end. Don't forget to hit that free red subscribe button down below and turn on all notifications so you're always notified whenever I post something new. And of course, hit that like down below, it just lets YouTube know I'm doing a good job. So until next time, get that money, get that honey, keep hustling and keep bustling, and we'll see you next time right here on Paid to Drive and pay to drive logs. And as always, drive safe, be well, and we'll see you on the next one. Peace, everybody. Later.